everyone, welcome back to the channel. It is Lake 8 here. In today's video, we're going to be looking at the brand new update that came with Creature of Sanaya, which is a rotation store. As I made a video on this a few days ago, talking about the update coming, and now it is here. In today's video, I'll be showing you guys the creatures that came into it, talking about the rotation store and everything that you really need to know about the update. Now, uh, if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe. We are very, very close to 11,000 subscribers. And also like this video if you guys want more of these update videos. It is very appreciated. And with that said, let's get right into it. So with this update, we have four creatures added into the rotation store, which is the Luxus, the uh, Levon Levonith, I think it's called, the Veldes, and the Teractu. These are the four creatures that are new and were added into the rotation store. And there's also other creatures that they were adding into the rotation store as well. They have adjusted and updated the store and other small parts of the UI, which I'll show later. And they adjusted the atmosphere and trade realm with a less intense. They added a new Bite SFX and they swapped out the following creatures from their respected gotchas into the rotation store. The ones added are the Lust Adage, the Sonata, the Veladora and the Bascaro, the Sakuratum, the Aimeoim, the Amalus, and the Lore. That is everything that came into this update, and now I'm going to go ahead and showcase to you guys all of the things that came in that I can really showcase you guys. So first, we'll go look at the adjustments and go over the rotation store. As you can see, the adjustments, we can kind of see a difference with some of the buttons as well as over here as well. Uh, I'm thinking that's when they actually reset. Oh yeah, this is the time that we'll have for the um, shop. If you want to go to the rotation store, you can hit this. Well, I'm pretty sure you can hit this. And you want to go all the way down to limited creatures. And it's going to have a timer. It's going to say 20 something or it depends on the time that it will rotate. Right now, I got the lore, the Amelis, the Baskerel. Um, in these, as you can see, this one's a thousand. This one's a thousand. This one's seven thousand. And I'm pretty sure... I'm going to go ahead and just buy this one to see if it's a store or not. Did it happen? All right, there you go. So now I have one of these. These are actually the species. You don't have to worry about anything else. So when you buy them, you buy the species, not the stored ones, which is, I think, pretty neat. And the new creatures are also in here as well. I don't think they're right now in there. I don't think there's any other way to get them other than the rotation store. So it seems that the rotation store is the only place that you can get these creatures, the new ones, as I looked in every single other one and it's not there. As well as the lore, Amulus, Barasco, and the other ones, they are all going to only be available in these uh, rotation store. Now I kind of wish they kind of went where you can have them in the rotation store, but you can also get them in a gotcha. I'm just saying that because I feel like it would be better. I'm not exactly sure though. But I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the new creatures that we have as well and then probably be ending the video. So the first one I'm going to show is the Valdez and this is kind of a griffin like horse and it also looks really cool. Um, it does have an ability and it does not have a breath. It looks actually, I really like the particles on it. I love the design. Like, I think this is one of my favorites because of the design. It just looks really good. And the model is also really good as well. Animations are pretty good too. Um, I think I haven't seen the sleep, but it looks pretty nice. Um, but yeah, it looks really cool. It does have an ability, which I'll show in a second. Uh, this is actually the, I would call it digging in the mud. I don't know. Um, so we also fly, as you can probably tell. I love the flying animation. We kind of like run in the air. And I think that's really cool. All right, swimming. Uh, we don't swim. Okay, I need to get out. <laughs> I'm about to starve as well, so I hope there's food around. Um, there's a Manawi there. Uh, I was gonna do something. Oh yeah, and the running is kind of the same as like the flying, in a way. I do have Dazzling Flash, but I'm gonna come back after I get some food. To kind of uh, show you guys, because you can't really necessarily see it, but it's kind of where you blind people. I just want to see the reaction. Okay, so I'm back. I actually ate, and uh, I'm just gonna use the ability. <laughs> I want to see people's reactions to this. I wonder if I blinded them. I wonder if that guy's AFK. Next to the Leo next is the Leonani. Uh, this guy actually surprised me with his animations. I didn't like his design when I first saw it, but I like him now because of his animations. He's so cute and like skinny. It's so cute. Oh my gosh. Um, but yeah, this is the guy. I love his animations. They just they're just awesome. I love his flying, especially. Like, look at this. You can't tell me this isn't good looking. It is so, like, ad adorable. <laughs> um, and it's run. 
This rent's not my favorite, but I would say it's one of them. He does not have an ability, nor does he have any uh, breath. He does have Omnivore Diet, and he is a tier 2. The other one was a tier 3. I just want to say that the one I showed you before. I forgot to show you guys. Um, so yeah, and he got a pretty good amount right here for a tier 2. I think he looks pretty cool. Uh, don't bite me, please. Um, there really isn't much else about this guy other than his looks and stuff since he doesn't have really anything else. Um, but yeah. That's kind of it for this guy. Next is the Tratu, which is a lion-like creature. And honestly, I'm kind of surprised about this one. I honestly like this one the most, and I don't know why. Just look at him. He looks so cool. Um, and he has, like, a really good animations, like he does. Even though I didn't really look at much of him. But he's kind of a lion-like, or I would say lion, tiger, something around that. This guy does not have an ability, nor does he have a breath. And he is a tier 4, surprisingly. That's actually surprising that he's a tier 4. I thought he was going to be a tier 3 from his looks. Uh, I didn't think he'd be this big either. Uh, but yeah, there's really nothing much else about this guy other than looking really cool, really good animations, and he actually has a pretty decent bleed. And I'm really glad that he does because, uh, I mean, what else would those teeth be doing? So this is the last one I saved for last because I think this one was going to be a tier 5, but it's actually a tier 4. Uh, so it's the same as the other one. But I said this one last because I thought it was going to be, like, you know, pretty good looking. And I like that this pixels. I feel like there's too much on the head, though. I feel like it should chill out a little bit on the head. But it's okay otherwise than that. I really like the particles here. And you can kind of see those little details on the, um, what would you call this? The tail. Yeah. I think it looks really neat. And its animations are actually really good. It kind of runs weird. But I'm liking it. Like, look at this. And uh, here's its aggro. <laughs> what? Why is it pointing? I'm, I'm not going to question. But that looks really good otherwise. Then we have its cower. Kind of like thinking. It looks like it's thinking. I don't know why it's doing that. But Oh, we have the invisibility. So it's kind of like the, uh, what's it called? The dev creature, the Kuro. But we do not have any breath, so you can turn invisible. And that's really all that we have for this guy. That's really all that's left for the video, actually. So I hope you guys did enjoy today's video. Comment down below what's your favorite creature about this. Uh, what's your favorite creature in this update? What's your favorite thing about it? And what you dislike about it the most? And uh, with that said, I'll see you guys later. Bye.